guys, it's Steph, and in today's video, I'm trying Del Taco. So, we are gonna see if Del Taco is better than Taco Bell. I actually haven't even watched that many YouTube videos on Del Taco, but I know it's really popular, and you guys have been telling me to get it on this little trip. So, I saved down on my phone a few items that I wanna try, because I was looking at their menu online. And shoot, the hay looks good. The burritos look really good. Um, I don't even know what type of like hot sauces they have either from here. Crispy, no. Shrimp, fish. Oh, they even have boba. Mmm, chipotle sauce. Okay, shoot, they have a big menu. I think I did everything good. I should have put Elma instead of Mouse. Hi, what can I get for you? Hi, can I get a ranch crispy chicken taco? And okay. Um, and then the spicy jack and regular cheese quesadillas. I don't know, does that come in like a one pack? Or? Uh, it's either the cheddar or the stuff. Okay, can I get one of each? Okay. And then can I get a chicken crunch burrito and a spicy grilled chicken burrito? Could I get a side of sour cream and a side of chipotle sauce? And also, I've never been here before. Uh, do you recommend anything? Um, the churros. Churros? Yeah, for oh. dessert. Yeah. Okay, I'll try a churro. Did you want the one piece or the two piece? They're pretty small. I'll do the two piece. Okay. And then maybe I'll also try um, the deluxe chili cheddar fries. Okay. And that should be it. Did you want to have a drink to order? Um, I'll get just a Coke. You want a small, medium, or large? Um, do a medium. Small, medium, okay. Yep, and then that'll be it. Alright, so I mean after lunch, crispy chicken taco, one cheddar quesadilla, one spicy jack quesadilla, yep. one chicken crunch burrito, one spicy chicken burrito, one side of sour cream, a side of chipotle sauce, a side of chipotle sauce, two mini churros, and then the deluxe chili fries and the top. Yep, sounds good. Alright, it's gonna be 24 drinks. Okay, thank you. No problem. I bet you guys are wondering. She's drinking a Coke? It's not for me. <laughs> I don't like pop. I do not. But Granny told me she wanted a soda before I left, so I was like, okay. I will get you a Coke. So 20 something bucks, not too bad. Not too bad at all. And then I need to see if they have like, what hot sauces they have. Trying this new lip gloss I got on this vacation. Okay. And then do you guys have like hot sauce packets or anything? Yeah, we have mild, medium, and hot. Okay, uh, I'll do the hot. Thank you. We're getting spicy today. Did I get a receipt? Could I get a receipt too with my order? Thank you. I got a question that asked me why I keep all my receipts. And I keep them for taxes. It helps me out a little bit. Because these are for the video. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, dokie. What was I talking about? I was talking about something, but I don't. Oh, this lip gloss I got, I was gonna share it actually on my TikTok too. Shoot, where do I park? Um, shoot, shoot, shoot. Oh, shoot. This is what I don't like about LA, I'll tell you that. Should I like just park illegally? I've been doing that a lot here. Haven't gotten in trouble yet. <laughs> uh, sorry, I didn't know where to go. I'm just gonna park right here. I don't think this is a spot, but. You know, you can kind of make any spot a spot. 
There's just no meter in this one. But I just, I thought this spot was free, that's all. <laughs> but this lip gloss, let me show you guys. Oh, I'm not even, never mind. I'm confused. Oh, here it is. I just put it on before this video and it has cute little teddy bears on the top of it. So cute. Too Faced Lip Injection. And I have a bunch of these lip glosses, but that one has teddy bears on it. Lock my doors. And I don't know why I cannot figure out how to work this steer. Oh, there we go. Upside down. And Del Taco, here we go. Let's see how. Oh wow, so many sauces. Okay, I was gonna say, let's see how many sauces they get. Sometimes Taco Bell forgets your sauces. So we got the hot, so I guess I should have tried all the sauces, because what if the hot is like too hot? We'll just man up and do it. So we got the spicy jack quesadilla. Grilled cheese quesadilla. I'm gonna move the camera this way a bit so it's like not distracting out the window. A little burrito. Another burrito. Another burrito. Churros. Love these things. Mr. Heroes. Love that place. Except we saw someone picking their nose behind the kitchen counter. The guy that was cooking the food. I haven't been back there since. It's been a while. Like, probably like two years. That place is good. And uh, no fork for the fries. But, okay. Okay, let's look at these fries. Ooh, these look messy. Those look really good, but really messy. Let's try one. Ooh, good fries. Crispy outside. Mmm, I love chili. These are pretty good. Cheese fries, I used to order when I was like younger as my meal at a dinner. <laughs> like, off the appetizer menu. Okay. Mm. Big cup of Chipotle, I love that. And sour cream. So, what do we try first? Let's try this massive one. Well, it's not that massive, actually. Compared to, like, Taco Bell. Okay, let's give it a try. Mmm. Okay. So you guys see the beans and cheese and all that in there. I feel like I haven't had a burrito in so long. Mmm. Oh god. I've not had like a fast food taco place like this in a really, really long time. Why does it say my phone is on a, a phone call? That's weird. Okay, well, you know, like I'm expecting this to have like that Taco Bell taste, but it doesn't at all. Here's what the inside of this looks like. Ooh. But yeah, it doesn't taste anything like Taco Bell because it's not Taco Bell, but it's like similar, you know? But, this one kind of has the same stuff as like the beefy bean burrito at Taco Bell. It doesn't taste like it. Okay, let's try this one. So they don't label them, so we don't really know. Oh, this is like the chicken crunch one with rice in it. I'm gonna dip this in chipotle sauce because I can already tell this bite right here is kind of dry with rice. Okay, let's see. Mmm. Okay, I already like this one a lot better. Mmm. And their chipotle sauce, really good. I'm also filming what I eat in a day in LA today. Mmm. Okay. This one, I would totally get again. So this is the chicken crunch. 
So today is my last day in LA. Sad. This trip went by so quick. Like honestly, I could have stayed here longer and filmed more things. Like there was still other places that I wanted to try and film at. So this is the Chipotle chicken little soft taco. And I'm gonna dip this one in sour cream. Seems like none of these have like sour cream on it. Taco Bell, I feel like most of theirs do have sour cream on it. And we'll go for the Chipotle. Mm. This one's pretty simple. Can't go wrong with some chicken and cheese and lettuce on a taco. I know, tortilla. That one's like colder because of the lettuce. But yeah, today is the final day. Tomorrow our flight is at like 11 or something in the morning. Okay, let's try this quesadilla. This one is the spicy cheddar jack. Cheese pool? Oh, cheese pool. Yeah. Ooh, and uh, yeah. And some sour cream. No, the other one's spicy jack. Okay, so Taco Bell's quesadillas, I definitely think are better, but let's try it in the Chipotle sauce, because isn't that what they put on their quesadillas? It's like the avocado sauce or something. Taco Bell's are just more like greasy. Hmm. But honestly, there is a good amount of cheese in this thing. Because we all know Taco Bell is very skimpy on their cheese in the quesadillas sometimes. Mmm. Can I go wrong with the quesadilla? Yesterday, we went to Santa Monica Beach. Hung out at the beach all day. And um, there was so many people on Santa Monica Pier. I'm talking like 10,000 people just on the pier. I have never seen it so crowded before. Everyone I was with was like, I've never seen it like this. Like it was insane how many people were there. Like crazy. Mmm. Okay, I like this one a lot. Let's try this hot sauce. Kind of looks like Taco Bell. Mm. Ooh, yeah, spicy. This has an interesting flavor. Hmm. Yeah, yesterday I played frisbee on the beach. And I went in the water one time. And it was so cold. So cold. My body went like numb. I was like screaming when I was like trying to go in the water. Like literally, I was like screaming. I can't help myself sometimes. Sometimes I just like scream so loud and I forget like I'm in public. <laughs> Honestly, I don't like the ocean. It's really pretty to look at, but kind of freaks me out. It does freak me out. Like, you see those TikToks where it's like, 
this is why I'm scared of the ocean. Then it shows you like those pictures like deep down in the ocean and how small you are and how deep the ocean is. Like how do we know more about outer space than we know about something on our own planet? The ocean. There is mermaids down there in the depths. Why can't I pronounce anything? My brain, I'm telling you. I don't know why I can't read or pronounce things. Okay, but anyways, deep down in the ocean that we haven't yet explored, I think there's mermaids. They don't probably look how like the pretty mermaids in the movies, but there's definitely something down there that looks similar. For sure. But yeah, that freaks me out. I totally love sharks though, which doesn't make sense because like I'm kind of scared of the ocean because I'm scared of sharks. But like at aquariums, I love like looking at the sharks. I think their mouths are so like cool and they just look so scary. So scary. But like I would go in a shark cage in the ocean like where they drop you down. Except those movies, like 49 meters down, scary because that could happen. Oh, I'd suck. <laughs> but can't always think of it like that. Anything you do daily can be dangerous. But yeah, the shark cages, I really want to do that. And like scuba diving. Yeah. These little crispy pieces in here. Don't have flavor, but good crunch. Oh shoot, I'm in the freaking bus stop. Oh shoot. Sorry. Oh gosh. I was in a bus stop. Oopsie. There was literally parking spots over here. Oh well, it happens. Oh, this is like nice in the shade a bit. Yeah, this is nice. Okay, anyways, the taco was half dipped in the chipotle. Luckily I didn't spill anything. Oh, just kidding, my churros are all over the floor. Oh, that's messy in this rental. Dang it, they're both on the floor. I don't wanna eat that. Should I? Yeah, that's really gross. Cause it's not like my own car. I like cannot believe how expensive the houses here in LA are. The Airbnb we're at now, it's a very nice Airbnb, but like, it's worth $5 million, and like in Ohio, that would probably be worth like 500, maybe a little more than that, like 700,000. It's like, why is it so expensive to live here? That's why I would never wanna live here, just because it's like, you can live somewhere else for so much cheaper and just travel a ton more with the money you're saving. Oh, these fries. Oh. So overall, I loved that crunchy taco the best. That's for sure. The hot sauce, I like Taco Bell's way more. Um, quesadillas, I'd probably say I like Taco Bell's more too, but they're good. They're good. Their chipotle sauce here, mmm, really good. And it's like a big cup of it. It's just like so hard to eat without a fork. I like can't eat that part.
time to go back to Ohio. Not looking forward to this flight though, because we fly like out of direction a little bit. I get so bored on flights, like I cannot just sit there. I, mean, I can't imagine a flight that's like 15 hours. And I know the seats are bigger and stuff, but like... It's just such a long time to be sitting there. And like just watching movie after movie gets so boring. But it's always worth it. I watch like two movies in a row on the way here. The one movie was actually really good. What was it called? Love and Monsters, I believe. I think that's what it was. This is so messy. Well, everybody, I am full. I'm so happy I got to taste test Del Taco here on my last day in LA. It's very good. I liked it a lot. I'm gonna bring this stuff home and have Ross try it. And uh, yeah, because he's never had it either. I wanted him to come, but he was busy. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Also click my notification bell so you guys never miss a video. And I'll see you all next time. Bye, guys.